the Detroit Pistons at 17 and 16, trailing the Milwaukee Bucks in the Central Division by four and a half. Jamal Wilkes into the big fella. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar for the first time in his career averaging under 20 points and it's knocked away. And it is goaltending call on the Pistons and that would be Terry Tyler. A lot of folks say, well, he's a great shooter and ball handler, but they say he's one of the better cutters. And in basketball is Isaiah Thomas. So he has learned a lot in one year. When Bill puts one through, but Pete, you know, he played for Bobby Knight. That means you play the motion offense. You've got to move without the basketball. Johnson to the trainer, Jabbar. And just like Magic, the Lakers are up 8-4. to four. Magic Lake had, excuse me, Pete, I was going to say, Magic had 16 assists the other night, and I'll tell you, he does whatever you need to do to win the basketball game. 17 points in the win against Seattle. Whole slew of steals, and he had 27 against Golden State on Tuesday. Here he is dishing off the assist to Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, and the Lakers doing their thing. Piston setting it up. Thomas and uh, Long, the guards. Johnson will come off the bench. Lane Beer hitting from outside. Lane Beer averaging 14-9. To really try and not use the thumb. Thomas is like another coach on this floor. This is a very young team with exception of Owen. Hey, Lane Beer is three for three. He looks pretty good. 12 to eight. The Lakers over the Detroit Pistons. Nixon working on Thomas. Takes him to the lane. Dishes off to Kareem. And Norm Nixon... The same Detroit ball club went in and won in Boston without Kelly Trapuca and Kent Benson. So they're very, very capable. They have been a much better road team. They haven't done the job at home, and that's what's been disappointing. Uh oh the big guy with a steal against Lane Beer. He's got 10. Jabbar, who is putting in an average of 19-9 on this season, has never, as I indicated, averaged below 20 in any season in his career. Well, look at that. Good hustle by Lane Beer. Get it back the other way. And Norm Nixon knocks it down for the fourth time from long range. He has eight points for 352 remaining in the quarter. He and Lane Beer have been the story outside. They've just been sensational. On Long trying to find some room. He's struggling a bit as Lane Beer again. What you'd almost have to say is out of his range, knocking it through. Lane Beer with 10. And Nixon got the hot hand. Why not? Hey, Somebody's going to have to get out there on him. Layups are for cowards. Keep it outside. <laughs> you got to like it. 35-20. <laughs> it's 15. The biggest lead. Lane Beer says, I, you know, I'm on. And hey, what is this? Nixon and Lane Beer. Hey, I'll tell you what. They're putting on a clinic. This one's got more 10-day contracts than the Godfather right now. Or, well, you make a great point. You can do that twice, and then you got to sign them or let them go. And Wilkes did hustle. Very effective that time. The lead is uh, 11 now for the Lakers. 35-24. Very heady ball players. Wilkes will pick it up in a hurry. No relation to Jamal. As Kareem turns around. 52-41. The Laker lead after Johnson knocks down his first two points from the free throw line. Second quarter today. Detroit 45% from the field. As Kareem gets back into the act. He has been silent for a while after getting out of the blocks in a blazing tempo. Guy uh, was uh, the first coach of the Jazz, and he's always wanted to get back in it. He's done a good job. I like his discipline. The book is that's a second try, and by golly, he is going to do it his way this time. His players are going to respond in his way. Jabbar goes one way and then comes back the other, 58-45. And, you know, this is his go-round, and uh, they're going to do it my way. You know, it's amazing, Pete, 18-point lead for uh, the Lakers. And right now, the boards are even at 16, something I just didn't think could happen. It shows you statistics means nothing. It's only the final count. And the Pistons are winning the offensive boards. Lane Beer from way outside again. That's where he has found it all, 14. Glad to see Johnny Davis found a home. Uh, Indiana finally, finally found something to do with him as Lane Beer comes home again. Johnny Davis uh, headed toward Atlanta now. Dick is all right. I'll tell you, he will flat get after whether he's coaching, being an analyst. I like him. If you could just get him up for the game. Yeah, if we could get him out of his shell. <laughs> <laughs> Jabbar trying to break from the shell of the teens as he goes to 20 points on the night for Kareem. Don Andreas pointed out that Kareem going more with the left hand this year. There's Lambeer. We've seen him three times. Oh. Lambeer, all of his points. From almost that spot, he has 18, nine field goals from long range. Telling you, Pete, that people to underestimate the guy. You watch him shoot in practice, and before the ball game, he is no joke. That guy can knock him down from the outside. You just get the feeling there is a guy that has made himself a player. 
Not a lot of great down <laughs> How about that, huh? What's good for you is good for me, Kareem says. <laughs> The proverbial yeah, seen, in your seen, face. I haven't seen him shoot a jump shot in five years. Funny about two points for Kareem as he and Lane Beer do it by satellite. Oh. Owens missing. Who got the tap? Was Lame that Lane Beer? Beer? First one inside. We're talking about Detroit, though. They got to win at home. You got to snuff people up on your home boards, and they just haven't done it at the Silverdome. Wilkes with the quietest 16 points you'll ever see. Lane Beer. 17 feet. <laughs> Whoa, what can you say? I like it. I tell you, I like the deal they made bringing him over from Cleveland. Boy, that really made some sense. This organization did their homework. 22 points for the former Notre Damer. <laughs> and it's, you know, I can do what you can do. Give up that baseline pretty easy after knocking down that jumper because Kareem just went around him like he was standing still. Check out, it's 90-78. Pistons really need one right now. Last two times, they haven't got a shot because of the trap. Look at this guy. Lame Beer equals his season's high, 24 points. Well, at least he varied the shot that time. Anyway, went from the corner. Well, look at the struggle underneath. Now, Kareem saying, okay, you had yours, number 40. My turn. It's every been that time, way all night. I'll tell you, every time Bill knocks one down, Kareem comes back with one. 92 to 80, 313 left in third. Lakers at 53% in this quarter now from the field. Detroit shooting 63%. A long break. It is Jabbar. It is absolutely automatic. Boy, the guy who made that possible is Magic Johnson with the block, then the pass. Kareem comes back and gives him a high five. There's Magic. The long pass. And Big Jabbar goes up, takes about one step from the free throw line to stuff it. All of a sudden, the Lakers by 18 after we had a good basketball game, and now the Pistons are just deteriorating. He had Double 10, and most of them from outside in the first quarter. So he has been quiet for a while. Got to be able to shoot in this league from the outside if you're a guard, unless you're a TR Dunn or somebody like that. But you also have to be able to shoot quick. And, uh, well, look at Lambeer. He has really had a fantastic night. He's a step slow, and it really showed up when McAdoo went around him before. But the guy is... Uh, you know, he is just doing the job, doing what they asked him to do when they picked him up. So Rambus has contributed his 11 points. He's pulled down two or three rebounds. Lane Beer. My heavens, is he hot. I don't have his percentage, but he has 28 points to equal Jabbar for top honors. Magic, Wilkes underhands it, doesn't go. Wilkes is out-rebounded by Edgar Jones. Edgar could hurt you out there. <laughs> he is exciting. Though. Here's Tyler again. He says, I, I got the hand. Rebound, Lane Beer. Lane Beer. And with the rebound, he now has 12 rebounds, and he has tied his career mark of 30 points tonight. Bill Lane Beer. Boy, did he rebound from a bad game against San Diego.